the pressure is on and opening game nerves can often take hold match day one for these two nations here at the 2024 uefa european championship who will be first to make their mark on the group live on ea tv And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And today, it's the opening game in this particular group at the Euros. Stuart, what are your expectations for today? Well, it's vital that you don't have an off day in these group games. Consistency is key to progressing further in the tournament. I'm looking forward to a hard-fought contest here today, Derek. Opportunity here. And a fine stop to turn the ball away. And the starting lineup for Denmark. Kasper Schmeichel stands between the posts. Andreas Christensen starts alongside Simon Kerr in central defence. Christian Eriksen plays alongside Pierre-Emile Heubier in central midfield. And so many different ways to... Eriksen! Oh, good save! The short corner routine. Vestergaard. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Hoylund could play it in. Moving forward effectively. Fabier. Vital intervention. Benjamin Sheshko. Denmark with the ball again. Mele. Read that pass all the way. Cutting it out. Well, shielding the ball admirably. Patient build-up at the moment. Could be dangerous. And keeping it out. Christensen. Clean challenge. He's going forward well here. That's not a bad ball. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. <laughs> He's driven in the corner. Now well, still an issue here. Doing well to win it back. What can they do from here? Opportunity! And the keeper more than equal to it. Ba. Here's Nurgard. Rasmus Heilun. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Can they forge ahead? Reading it well. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. And Denmark doing well to regain possession. Vestergaard. Mele. And support available. 
Oh, that's an interesting pass. And they might forge ahead. And a decent save. Full credit. And played short. Très bien. Rasmus Hoylun. Very quick thinking there. Chance maybe to use their counter-attacking ability to good effect. And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. Now he prevented it from going over the line. And they know they need to stop him. Ericsson. Can they forge ahead from this corner kick? Let's see. And deciding to go short with this one. Christian Nurgard. And Hoybier with it. Couldn't hang on to it. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. So they get the ball rolling in the second half. Even Steven here. So little to choose between the sides. Takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Poibier. Eriksson lost possession. Alexander Bar and Christensen Bar Hoylund and after that fantastic effort it's gone out for a throw in and a substitution in the offing Well, possibilities in the centre. Brilliantly blocked. And a vigorous effort, but denied by the woodwork. Well, from that sort of distance, it's a chance that should be taken. the keeper needed to do an awful lot better Mele Jonas Vint big chance and it's in 1-0 they breach the defence Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. And the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Bora. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful, but nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Could cross it in here.
Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. A chance to whip it in. Pulls it back. Magnificent defending. And they will make the change now. Who can he pick out? It might still be problematic. Well, that was incisive. Good defending in the end, and danger averted for now. Intense pressure. Christensen. Effective challenge. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Taken away, he won the ball. And it'll be a throw for Denmark. They decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Morten Hulman. Christian Eriksen now. Nicely timed tackle. Now we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one. Well, no time to waste. Can they find an equaliser? Really good build-up, but no end product. Alexander Bach. Rasmus Hoilun. Morten Hulman. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Eriksson! Off the post and back in play. Oh, he's blocked it! Well, that would certainly have put the game to bed, but there's still a bit of time left here. And it took a little nick before it went over the touchline, so a throw in here. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. And they have possession again. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, two minutes to be added on. Seemingly cannot keep hold of the ball here. It's opening up for them. And the final whistle. And this will do nicely for Denmark. A victory recorded. Stuart, your thoughts on their performance? Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team and they deserve their victory. Well, there's a good reason why we're highlighting him. Really dominant in attack in this game, Stuart. Well, he was excellent today, and he gave them that all-important lead. They just struggled to cope with him. His movement was so clever.